Yeast turns juice into alcohol. But why? And how? The simplest explanation is that yeast use these sugars and other compounds in the juice to create energy for themselves, and they use that energy to reproduce. Yeast are single-cell organisms, but just because they're so simple doesn't mean they don't eat just like all the rest of us. Except when you eat a slice of pizza, you don't get alcohol as a byproduct. Though, that would be pretty cool. Yeast absorb the sugars inside of them and convert them to something called pyruvate. That pyruvate is first converted to acetaldehyde through a reaction catalyzed by pyruvate decarboxylase, which releases carbon dioxide. The acetaldehyde is then reduced to ethanol by the enzyme alcohol dehydrogenase. So essentially, the pyruvate is broken down into both ethanol and carbon dioxide. Then, energy is released, helping the yeast to reproduce. Fermentation is a wildly complex process, even though it's happening way down on the molecular level. And Saccharomyces cerevisiae, the yeast that we use most commonly in brewing, is one of the most specialized organisms on the planet. So in the process of making beer, you're kind of a farmer. That instead of your flock being out there making wool or dairy milk, they're out amongst those liquid fields of grain turning sugar into booze.